Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Bill. In today's video, we are going over the archetypes from the uh, Ultimate Magic book from 1E Pathfinder. Uh, and we are entering the Bard archetypes now. So the first one of the Bard al Alchemy, uh, of the Bard archetypes is Animal Speaker. An animal speaker focuses not on the ears and minds of the humans, but on creatures of the wild and those in the underbellies of cities. Animal friend. An animal speaker selects a particular kind of animal, such as apes, badgers, bears, boars, cats, snakes, and so on. The bard gains a plus four to handle animal checks to influence animals of this chosen kind. Animals of this kind have a startling attitude, uh, a starting attitude, of at least indifferent towards the bard and never attack him unless he attacks them first. Animal companions and magically controlled animals of the bard's chosen kind can be directed to attack the bard if the controlling creature wins an opposed charisma check against the bard. Supernatural versions of animals can attempt an opposed charisma check against the bard with a plus four bonus on the roll to overcome this hesitation. This ability has no effect on creatures other than animals. This ability replace, replaces Fascinate. Nature's Speaker. At 5th level, 11th level, and 17th level, the animal speaker selects another kind of animal friend. The bard can use Speak with Animals at will on animals of his selected kind. This ability replaces well-versed. Bardic performance. An animal speaker gains the following types of bardic performance. Soothing performance. At third level, an animal speaker can use bardic performance to influence animals. This works like a druid's ability, wild empathy, except he expends one round of bardic performance and makes a perform check. If the bard already has wild empathy from another class, he adds the class level that provides Wild Empathy to the result of his perform check to influence an animal. This ability replaces Inspired Competence. Attract Rats. At 6th level, the animal speaker can use Bardic Performance to summon 1d3 rat swarms. They remain as long as he continues performing. At 11th level, he summons 2d3 rat uh, swarms instead of 1d3. And the swarms have the Advanced Creature Simple Template. At 17th level, the number of swarms he summons increases to 3d3. This ability replaces Suggestion. So, like the Pipe Piper. Summon Nature's Ally. At first level, the Animal Speaker adds Summon Nature's Ally 1 to his Bard spell list as a Bard spell known as a first level spell. At fourth level, whenever he gains access to second level spells, he adds Summon Nature's Ally 2 to his list of spells known as a second level spell, and so on every three levels thereafter until 16th level when he adds Summon Nature's Ally 6 to his sixth level spell list and spells known. This replaces Mass Suggestion. So for losing a few abilities, you can hit the Pied Piper Animal Friend feel pretty well with this Animal Speaker. I like it. I can see it being very fun to play. Well, until we meet again.